you know today is going to be a cold one when there's condensation and ice on the inside of the window it looks cold out there today have you seen all these circles on the window what are they Hey, hey, good morning and welcome back to another video. The weather is truly messed up. The day we landed, it was 18 degrees. Yesterday, it was 16 degrees. Today, it is minus two, but with the wind chill, it's gonna feel like minus seven. So we're wrapped eight. up. A minus eight. Minus eight, that's even worse. <laughs> so we're wrapping up a really warm today. I did purchase the hop on, hop off bus tour. I did this the last time we were here and it was amazing. We walked so much yesterday. Our feet are actually really hurting still this morning. So that's why we purchased a ticket. So our first stop of the day, we're gonna head for breakfast and then we're gonna go down to the 9-11 Memorial. Oh my goodness, I can feel the cold. Ah, it's stinging. Oh my, wow, that's cold. How has this weather changed within 24 hours? Wow! Right at the back, where we're gonna freeze. I'm not using this computer. We're gonna freeze. I have a feeling you may need to defrost me when we get off this bus. I just sat on the chair and it feels like ice. But the kids decided they wanted to sit upstairs. I don't think they realized that when the bus starts moving and the wind hits you, it's gonna stick. On my way down memory lane, you and me long time ago. And we were teens with tremendous dreams, always playing king and queen. We had set our minds to leave, face the world on wheels. Cross the borders of Morocco Take a journey to Dubai Fight the pirates stuck in Disneyland Paris Take a swim in salty water Drinking stars and holy sun And then we cross America Woo. I said I needed defrosting and defrosting is what I need And you know what? I wish I never had ripped jeans on because my legs are now numb here. They're red raw. Looking back about 20 years or so, when I close my eyes, I see how we all were tripping with beliefs. Ooh, and our hearts were young and free. We had set our minds to leave. Face the world on wheels Cross the borders of Morocco Take a journey to Dubai Fight the pirates stuck in Disneyland Paris Take a swim in salty water Drinking stars and holy sun And then we cross America My nose is stinging and it's so red <laughs> but we've just walked the length of the Brooklyn Bridge and it was 1.1 miles in each direction. Now my plan for when we got to Brooklyn was to head into Dumbo and get the photo of the Brooklyn Bridge with the Empire State Building in it. That did not happen because when I Google mapped it, it was a further 20 minute walk from where we were. The boys were never gonna do that with me. So I'll have to say that for another trip. But now we're walking over to the 9-11 Memorial and then hopefully we're gonna get the Staten Island Ferry because it's free over to the Statue of Liberty. But I've said this a million times. How can it go from 18 degrees to minus seven within 48 hours? The guy was just telling me that this church in front of me was the only building not to be affected from the 9-11 attacks. He also told me that they made this in the shape of a dove's wing from parts of the Twin Towers.
nose still red. My cheeks are absolutely stinging. They've got windburn. But we spent a bit of time down at the 9-11 Memorial and we went in the shopping centre. Then we jumped back on the bus down to Battery Park. And now we're just heading into the Staten Island ferry port to get the ferry over to Statue of Liberty. Well, not actually into Statue of Liberty, over to Staten Island and back again. And then when you get to Staten Island, apparently you can't stay on the ferry. You've got to get off and then you've got to go through all the departures back onto the other ferry to go all the way back. <laughs> They pull you from every direction, especially when they see kids. They're grabbing them. They're mean. They're trying to grab me 24 seven. <laughs> the Grinch is there now, Carter. How many of them can there be? We have had such a busy day today, and we haven't eaten since breakfast. The kids grabbed a Burger King, but Gethin and I haven't eaten. And it's too early to have dinner, but too late to have lunch. So we're gonna go to our favorite pizza place and grab another slice of pizza to keep us going. Because hopefully, tonight, we'll stay up later than eight o'clock. I can't promise, mind. Best pizza in New York. Drama's pizza. Cheese in the bag, sweet tomatoes and fresh garlic. Very good. Ah, like that? Yeah? Uh, my, uh, yeah? What? One of them, please. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Two cheese, two of them. Gracias. What do you think your pizza? Lovely. Yeah? A 4.9 out of 10. A 4.9? <laughs> my two favorite things. Snapple and cheese pizza. I've got to try Joe's pizza now just to see how it compares. But honestly, this is a little gold mine. Pizza! Oh, mine, no mine. <laughs> mine. Yes. No mine. That's why I said gold mine. That's a gold mine. I've trained you well. My second home. But actually. G -A -R -G -E -T -T. Actually, it's your first home on this trip. I've never seen you walk so fast. You watch, they'll all be gone now. They'll all be gone. And he's off. <laughs> he knows where they are as well. I'm coming, hold on. Which ones are you going to get? <laughs> two. You're getting two of everyone? Yeah. I've only got so much luggage, mind. Why are you getting so early? I don't know. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Yet again, I have been dragged to every sports shop in Manhattan. This is number four. <laughs> You're watching it, do you? Do you know what you're watching? Oh, it's the trainers. I thought you were watching the TV. I watched. <laughs> Number five. 
we came to our old faithful tonight, Olive Garden. We wanted to try somewhere new, but we tried all the places in Times Square, but it is absolutely rammed here. It's Saturday night and there's people everywhere. So tonight, after walking all of Manhattan today, we just decided we're just gonna go back to where we know and where it was quick, because our hotel is literally just there. So, what are you doing to me? Oh, so you thought you would scold my hand with it? Yes. To be honest, I don't even need to look at the menu. I know. I'm going to go with the tour of Italy again, which was this one here. It was so good. Carter's favourite thing of all time. Oh, thank you, sir. You can't pinch the salad. <laughs> I'll pinch the breadsticks then. Okay. What did you get? You don't know what you got. <laughs> Oh, they look like prawns. They are. They are, yeah. Oh, okay. What are these? I think they're peppers. Deep fried peppers. Yeah. That looks nice. Carter got his old faithful. I don't broccoli, like either. broccoli cheese pasta with shrimp. Oh, sh shrimp, isn't it? Shrimp, yeah. Yeah. And I had the same as the other night. You get a lasagna, carbonara, and then chicken with marinara and cheese. I want to try one of them now, I'm intrigued. Well, I'm not going to eat a fish now, am I? They're good. So it's not like um, a South, is it Southwest sauce? No, but it's spicy. Ooh. That's really spicy. What's this one? This is marinara sauce. That is really good. And what was it called? Journey, no idea. <laughs> Seen the picture. It's an appetizer. That is really good. Are you going to share this with me? My eyes will tell the whole story of how much I am done for today. I am well and truly beat. The amount of walking we have done the last couple of days is insane. So I'm calling it a timeout for today. We're not doing any more but we're gonna do it all again tomorrow. And I'm looking in the lens and I can see how red my face is. The wind chill today has been brutal. It stung all my face. But tomorrow it's two degrees warmer, so I'm gonna take that. But I'm gonna finish the video here. Thank you so much for watching. Tomorrow we're hoping to go to Chinatown, Little Italy and Soho. So if you would like to see us for our next New York adventure, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and click that bell for post notifications. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.